Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to scan and hopefully recover information from a corrupt hard drive on your computer. So we're pretty much going to be going through the diagnosis phase in this kind of video, and we're going to see if we can automatically re repair and affix changes to your drive that are causing it to be corrupt. So this should be a fairly quick tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. This isn't going to be a really in-depth, detailed hard disk recovery tutorial. This is a more simple tutorial that I would recommend trying first before you really send it in to the professionals or you actually start taking your hard drive apart. So we're going to just do what I would suggest as the first method here. And that would be to open up the start menu and type in command prompt. Best match should say command prompt right above desktop app. You want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control window, you want to select yes. Now we're going to minimize the command prompt for a second here. And now we're going to go back to the start menu and type in this PC. Best match should say desktop app. You want to open it up. Windows 7 and Windows 8, you can probably just type in computer and get to the same screen here. And underneath devices and drives, you want to take note of whichever device you're experiencing the issue with. So it happens to be the one that we are running Windows off of. So that's our C drive here. As you can see in the parentheses, it says C. If you had any external media, it could be the D, E, F, or anything up to Z drive, basically. And since it is a drive that Windows is installed on, we are going to have to restart our computer once we are done running this command. So just keep that in mind and also take note that we are using the C drive as our main drive that we're having the problems with. If you had another drive, you're more than welcome to swap out the C that we're going to be using in this video with whatever letter you guys need. So we're going to go back to the command prompt here. And we're going to type in CHK, DSK, space. Now I'm going to type in my C, colon. So colon should be one dot on top of another dot. Another space, forward slash F. So again, CHK, DSK, space, C, colon, another space, forward slash F. Now you want to hit enter. It should say the check disk cannot run because the volume is in use by another process. Would you like to schedule this volume to be checked the next time your system restarts? Like I said, because Windows is currently using this folder or this drive, we are unable to run the scan at this present time. So I'm going to type Y and then I'm going to hit the enter key and it will say this volume will be checked the next time your system restarts. Now if you had any external media, I do not believe you would need to restart your computer because as long as you close out of any programs or applications or files you're working on within that drive, you should be able to scan it without any hassle. Now you won't be able to read or write to the drive while the scan is taking place, but assuming you're already having data problems with that drive, I'm assuming you probably wouldn't have any interest in doing that anyway. So just be patient, this will take some time once you restart your computer depending on your hard disk size. But I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out, and I do hope you're able to recover data from your hard drive at the end. Now, there are other videos and tutorials that get much more in-depth and technical, but this is a very simple tutorial, and I would recommend trying it as a first attempt, to be honest with you guys. So, I do hope this brief video was able to help, and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.